Really happy with the way the guys bounce back. Obviously, Lance Lynn, huge pick me up. He was terrific. So, uh, a good way to kick off this series for us. What made Lynn so good? I thought <clears throat> both his fastballs, the two seamer and his four seam fastball, so the ability to pitch at the top of the zone. We saw a lot of elevated fastballs from him that was effective, but also that two seamer, that sinker he works down at the bottom of the zone. I thought those, you know, he mixed in enough off speed, but I thought it was about the, the two planes with the fastball. Just two outings for you guys thrown 11 and two thirds score innings I believe what were your expectations when you originally acquired him um, he's, he's been a consistent worker worse in his career and we thought he had pitched better than his numbers had indicated so far this year with the twins we definitely thought he was coming on and starting to pitch even better um, you know the month or two before we got him much more resembling the guy we've seen throughout his career and you know we feel like uh, we got a guy that can a capable guy, capable of giving us a lot of innings. How in the winter week, everyone, just how much in general was this needed? Um, look, it's it's it was a you know a, a tough day coming in here, just just with the travel, I think, and um, you know for the guys to come out and, and play well, I thought our energy was good, and we got to keep that going tomorrow. Um, so it was a good start to this series, and and uh, and and hopefully CC can take it from here tomorrow. Aaron, you said there was, you were waiting for that one game that things can turn around on a dime for you. Is this the kind of game that can do that? I hope so. <laughs> um, look, we know we're really good. And the guys, I don't think, have any doubt in there. And I think to a man, they understand that uh, what we're capable of. Um, and when you get strong starting pitching like that, um, you know, and also a day to kind of reset our pen right, right there. That's huge, you know, um, to give some guys down there that could use a day down was big. So, uh, Hopefully this uh, gets us rolling a little bit. How much did you see of Lynn in St. Louis, and was tonight reminiscent of his yeah. good time there? Yeah, I saw him a ton, actually, um, over the years. And uh, he's a guy that pitches with his heater. You know, he, he is he's kind of fearless out on the mound, the ability to fill up the strike zone. Um, but, again, I think using a little more four-seamer and, um, and again, mi mixing in enough secondary to really keep those hitters honest. Aaron, obviously it's against the White Sox who haven't had a good season, but are you surprised by Lance Lynn's performance? No, no, um, no. I, I I've seen this guy pitch like this for most of his career, and uh, when he came here, I felt like uh, you know we were getting a guy that's very capable of of this, and and uh, like I said, I, he's been pitching a lot better the last couple of months, and and hopefully. Uh, this is what we can expect to see uh, routinely. Did you think of the White Sox version of uh, Otani there in the eighth? <laughs> <laughs> Not bad. I mean, that little spinning that breaking ball up there, popping the low 90s, like, I think that's a little bit of an asset, you know, to have that and preserve people and, you know, uh, you know, he, he made it tough on our guys. You got to try that with Hicks? <laughs> I mean, he always bugs me about it, but I don't, I don't think that's happening. <laughs>